Got 314 North Hicks up here in Clinton. Uh, we are here just off the main drag. You can see red light right there. Just off the main drag here in Clinton. On a, seems to be a fairly main road. Seems to be pretty busy. Sidewalk access, shared stair access with the neighbor here. Uh, driveway is in the back. I'll show you when we walk around, but you, you pull up. I didn't see it when I was pulling up, so I parked in this parking lot. But driveway is actually right here shared driveway for both houses as well but to the house um walk around the outside doesn't seem to be in t too terrible shape there are some uh some foundation issues that i've seen i'll show you the one on the other side it's a small shift it is a solid brick foundation so but vinyl on the siding seems to be in good shape. Just needs to be cleaned up. Got some stuff here on the front porch. Bushes to trim. Railing actually looks like it's in decent shape up here. Just need to get all this chicken wire off. All the crap off of here too. So as long as there's nothing in too terrible shape behind behind that couch you're good but keep going around the house here it's got a large package unit it looks a little oversized for the house but that's that's all right um need some downspout drains look here at the back of the house Again, some more stuff. They've got tags on the on the door. City of Clinton's coming after them for leaving stuff out. So some a little bit of gutter repair, downspout repair. There's some siding repair here at this back door. So a couple pieces need to be replaced there. Gas service comes in here. Electrical service comes in here. Uh, have not found the water meter yet. But here is this, this foundation issue. You can't quite tell from this angle. Let's see. Yeah, we've had a little bit of shifting here. So crack all the way down. That will definitely need to be fixed. Um, again, some more downspout drain here, paint around the windows, just clean up, more gutter work down there, gutters hanging off. Um, didn't notice anything on the chimney inside, so that's good. Again, more downspout drains, downspout drains. So we'll go inside now. All right. <clears throat> so inside the back door, got. I don't think we need to add a step there. It's, if we do, it's just a tiny little landing that we'll need to add. So you walk in here to the laundry, just right there to the left. Water heater is to the right. Store space to the right of the water heater. Take another step up into the kitchen here. Dated cabinets. They have definitely seen worse cabinets, but they. Eh, and just guess it just depends on what direction we want to take this house in. Dining room. It's got old wallpaper uh, in here. It's got the 
ceiling panel boards, and here it is sheetrock. And there in the laundry room, it is also sheetrock. Okay, straight off the dining room, off this little hallway is the bathroom. Um, decent vanity, doesn't, doesn't look too old. And the tile looks to be in good shape in this shower as well, except for, well, no. Maybe just some, uh, well, I know there's cracking all in that anyway. So yeah, I think all that needs to come out. Uh, look at the rest of this. Got a small closet in this bedroom, or in this bathroom, I mean. Go to the bedroom at the back of the house here. Paneling on the wall. Again, just decide what direction we want to take this house in. Uh, it's third type of ceiling in the house. Uh, it does have hardwood floors on here. Uh, this laminate in the bathroom, laminate in the kitchen, dining room, that old hallway. Same ceiling in this living room as the dining room. So we're still at three types of ceiling. Does have replacement windows. Haven't seen a window that isn't a replacement window yet. So that is always nice to see. Again, hardwoods in here, hardwoods in there. So from the looks of it, Looks like they just covered the hardwoods with this stuff. So there is no telling what that looks like underneath, but it's definitely worth tearing that up, seeing what it looks like and seeing if it's worth saving or if we just tear it up and go right back over it with something new, some new LVP. And then front bedroom here. So two bedroom, one bath. I will get the square footage before I leave and go down our list, our list items to check. What a good size closet.